to Dame Does Say and today I'm back at you guys with another video. So today's video is actually going to be a purse haul. Your girl is starting to become obsessed with purses. Um, I have, I don't really carry purses because I grew up in the hood, which I'm proud of where I'm, I'm from, okay? Like, because it made me, trust me, street smarts is a real thing. And if you don't have street smarts out here, you will get got. I have literally witnessed people get got because they don't have street smarts. So you got to have street smarts out here. So, um, yeah, growing up in the hood, I never really wanted to bring purses because I was just like, you're not about to come jack move me. You're not about to try to hit a lick. You're not about to do none of that. You're about to run up on me. So I never carried purses because I just learned. Like from being in the hood, you know, waiting at the bus stop, um, you know, so like I just realized like they be fucking people up for their bags and you're not about to fuck me up. Like you're not about to match this face up. So I never used to carry bags. But now, you know, I'm getting older getting grown I when I go out to dinners and stuff I want to have a cute bag on my arm so I decided to get into buying bags um, crime happens everywhere but you know this shit was like an everyday occurrence where I came from like niggas was literally punching bitches in the face and taking their bag so it was literally happening so now that I'm like a little you know a little further away from all of that I decided to start venturing into buying some purses so I know it was a long spiel as to why I didn't wear purses and why I wasn't you know buying them that much but now that I feel a little bit more comfortable and I'm getting older, like I said, and I want to go out with my girls or my man and have a cute bag to set on the table, you know, you want to set it down real cute, I decided it's time to go ahead and get some cute purses. So, if you're interested in these cute, affordable purses, then go ahead and stay tuned. Alright y'all, that intro was a hot mess because I am a fool. Like, y'all don't even understand. If you know me in real life, you know that I am a whole jokester. I love to joke and tell stories, but it be real shit. Like, that's really real. Like, I literally saw one lady literally get punched in the face for her purse. One lady who was actually coming from work, an older woman, got mugged. And they punched her in the mouth. An older woman. Could have been, been their grandmother. Could have been their mother. And they punched her in the face, took her purse and her lunch bag and jumped the, like our fence to run. And I'm like, this is fucking psychotic. So I just never made myself a target. I never wore flashy jewelry outside. Never did none of that because you're not about to play with me. But <laughs> now that you know the backstory of why I wasn't wearing purses and why now I'm comfortable wearing purses, let's get to the video. This first bag is from Ross. It is a Nine West bag. And just so you guys can see it up close and personal, baby. It is a Nine West bag, and I love black and gold bags. I just have a thing for black and gold bags, um, but I love chains on a bag too. Like, I love hardware. I'm a hardware person. I love, like, big, chunky hardware on bags. I love, like, chains on bags. I just love hardware, like, prominent hardware on bags. So, yeah, when I saw this bag, my mom was going to get it at first, but I was like, this bag is just not enough for you. Because she always carries those big bags. I'm like, why would you get this? This is not, First of all, this is not a big everyday bag. This is a like, your man taking you to lunch and you want to, or to dinner, excuse me. The nice restaurant, you want to just sit your bag down real cute because it has the base to it too. And the chains just fall, you know what I'm saying? Like, it's one of those sexy like, oh, you taking me out to dinner, babe? Oh, okay. You know, you just want to lay it down. And that's what this bag is giving me. So I don't know where she thought she was going to go every day with this. And that's what I told her. Because I'm honest like that. Um, but yeah, it's a Nine West bag. It has the chain detail there. Which I love. This bag is called the Nine West Nanning. I want to say. I don't know if that's the name of the bag. Yes. I put all those things in it. It did not come like that. Because I didn't have it really stored anywhere. Because I knew I was going to film this video. But yeah. And this bag is normally $48 it says. Comparable value is $48 I got it for $22.99 $22.99 it does say nine west here on the front open it up it's literally like brand spanking new a lot of room in it that's what it looks like at this little middle section you can actually put things in yeah it's a pretty decent size bag it has a zippered pocket in the back it has you know the open pockets in the front so it's a pretty decent size bag and I love that it has a structured base because I hate bags that are like this like satchel type bags or you know like 
bags shaped like this and they don't have a base that pisses me off like they don't have like you know how it how it's shaped it's wide enough it's slim at the top and wide enough at the bottom that it actually will sit on its own i hate persons that do not have a base like that it really pisses me off so that is the first bag super freaking cute the second bag that i got is also from raw and y'all let me just disclaimer this i love cheetah print i'm a cheetah print girl love cheetah print everything like for at one point i had cheetah print sandals cheetah print belts cheetah print shirts actually not at one point i still do like i refuse to throw out my cheetah print stuff because i'm like y'all bring it back every 10 years or so i'm keeping my stuff and when it comes back in trend your girl gonna wear it whether it's in trend or out of trend i really don't care but i'm just saying i'm gonna be ahead of the game because i already have it <laughs> y'all was over here sleeping on cheetah and i was grabbing them all up so with that being said this is a cheetah print bag it is so freaking cute it's like a bowling bag i think they call it the bowling ball bags or so maybe i am wrong but this is it i think it is called that like the style of it but this is what it looks like you guys how freaking cute is this oh my oh yep there goes the color so fucking nice um and it comes with a little like card holder and it is steve madden again guys it is name brand it also has steve madden embossed at the bottom you guys can see that steve madden embossed down there it does come as a you can wear it as a crossbody excuse me so it does have the um, strap there for you but it is removable so you can remove the strap if you want to have like the bowling ball just bag effect um it is very freaking cute i'm telling you um let's look inside i haven't even like y'all think this is a joke i just literally bought the bags and i just had them here because i knew i wanted to show you guys so this is what the inside looks like it's a lot of space it says steve madden all over the inside has the two exposed or open pockets on this side and then on this side it has a zippered pocket that has the cheetah detail let me see and it goes all the way down so it's a pretty dope bag and again this bag has a base so it will sit wherever you put it my obsession i love bags that have bases like i really mean that so this Again, it's Steve Madden. It is the Leopard Mini Brevi, is what it's called. It's normally 78, for, I'm sorry, can you see my face? It's normally $78 for this freaking bag. And at Ross, they had it for $27.99, and then they reduced it to $19.99. So nobody was checking for this bag because the price went down, and I said, let me scoop. I think it's so cute. I should probably be showing you guys how these bags look on. So let me get my lazy ass up and show you guys. So this bag, like this on the arm, it's really cute. Oops, I could get it together. Yep. Hope you wanna hold it, it's cute. And then this bag, the Steve Madden one. And this one you can wear on your shoulder like this, which this bag would be cute with this outfit. I had a cheetah print belt in my previous haul where I showed this outfit and I was like, yes. But I like the bag with it too. And you know, you can wear it over the head if you wanted to. Granted, it's gonna be super, like I don't like that because it's like really close. So yeah, it's more of a shoulder thing. But it does have um, adjustable belt here not belt but it's adjustable so you actually can make it longer if you want to throw it around your shoulder like that and then you can wear it like this without the uh, these on them I have to cut the things to be able to take it off but yeah it's cute especially like just on the wrist first like what it's super cute 
So yeah, my outfit was looking real good. Look, crazy looking but yeah that's that and then um another bag that i have let me just show you guys what it looks like on the back all right so this bag i actually got from target i love freaking target and i used to get a lot of my purses from target like i said i don't really i never used to really wear them because i just didn't want to have like Nobody dragging me across the ground trying to take my shit. But I saw this backpack and I was like, Target, you coming back around, honey? Because for a moment they had some really ugly bags in Target. And now they like picking it back up. Like, what, sir, what? Ma'am, what? This bag's cute as hell. So it's by some, uh, what is it? Violet Ray is the brand. Um, and I bought it for $34.99. It's like a suede-ish material, it feels like, but it's not. I don't know how to describe it, but it's super nice. Um, so this part opens, and it is functional. So you can put items here. The zippers are nice and heavy, and I love the detailing, the gold. Like, I told you I love hardware on purses. Like, I love purses that have, like, hardware. Um... I love that it's like gray with the gold detailing. I think that's what really makes it bomb. In the front, it has a pocket as well that zips open. And you can put things in there. And then you can open it from the top. And it also has a lot of room up here, like a lot of room. Um, so that's the zipper on this side that you're seeing. It has the open pockets on this side. It's very deep, like my hand literally fits all the way down there. So it's pretty deep, it's nice. It's a really, really nice bag for $34.99 at Target. Do not sleep, it is so bomb. And it feels like really, really good quality. So, yeah. And then the last bag that I have for you guys is actually another Steve Madden bag. I'm, I'm really, really starting to love Steve Madden bags. So give me one second, let me I am back with the bag. And I sorry, I think majority of the I was staring here and I apologize. I keep forgetting to look here. But um, this is the next bag that I wanted to show you guys. And I thought about it and I actually got it from Ross where I got the other bag that I just showed you guys. So yeah, this is the bag. I think it is so cute. Like I said, and I'm gonna say it again, I love hardware. I love huge, prominent, like, I just love hardware on a bag, and this is the cutest. I've been wearing it around this whole time with the sticker still on here. They probably thought, this bougie bitch. It ain't even like that store. Got this on sale. I don't remember how much I got this for. 30 I think I spent $33 that day, so I think I actually got this for 20 But uh, I'm going to try to find this bag so I can um, link it for you guys because I should have saved it, um, but I didn't save it. I'm sorry, y'all, but... It has like a Steve Madden tag here. Um, and then what I really loved, what drew my eye to it, was that it has this lock there that I thought was the cutest freaking thing ever. Let me just get it to focus on it for us. Okay, perfect. So it says Steve Madden on the bottom, and then it has the lock here for you to lock and open the bag. And you have to twist it here to open it. I just thought that was the cutest thing. And it's heavy. It's like legit a heavy um, lock that you use to close the purse. I just thought it was super cute. I love that it has the big chunky um, clasps here. Same here. And then like I said, it has the, the little uh, Steve Madden tag there. Um, you can hold it like this. It's like a cute little handbag. Or you can wear it um, up crossbody or on your shoulder I wear it as a crossbody because again that's like it's more secure if anybody tries and fight um but yeah this is like a cute little like I just need to throw my phone maybe some lip gloss some tampons or something in here I think it's a cute like everyday bag in my opinion um if you extra like me then yes it's a cute everyday bag <laughs> um but yeah it's not that spacious so literally if you're carrying minimal things and usually on a regular basis i'm a minimalistic ass girl so like i'll have my phone maybe some lip gloss but now that we wear the um masks i mean i still put chapstick in here i put it on when i'm in the car or lip gloss when i'm in the car 
um and you know my my wallet so yeah this is a cute ass bag like steve madden be coming through with the purses like i think i'm really a madden girl when it comes to these purses like they be killing the design elements on these so yeah that is it guys for my purse haul i hope you guys enjoyed it let me know if you guys want me to do more purse hauls because i always go into ross and marshall's and find super cute purses so if you guys want um i can do purse hauls for you and then find them at, a, at the cheaper or same price that i bought them for you and link them down below so let me know if you want that because i actually really enjoy doing this purse haul because i really enjoy these purses like i'm so into purses now it's crazy so yeah um let me know what you guys want to see and until next time um i hope you guys stay healthy stay blessed if you want to see my videos when i do upload them please go ahead and subscribe turn on your notification bell if you actually enjoy my content and comment and rate let me know like y'all want more of these type of videos or not nah? okay all right, bye guys.